All right, I'm ready for another part. Uh, hey everyone, welcome back to World of Final Fantasy. In the last part, I recruited Billy and Zane because you know it's it's like a bihydra. There's two heads. In this part, well, who knows? But I hope to get out of this reactor. Even though I really like the setting of Final Fantasy VII, it's it's fantastic stuff. Oh man, I did a thing. But how will I ever get through the gate? Well, it showed there was another pathway here. It was blocked off. Or, yeah, it was blocked off. I'm not imagining things. There was a gate. I think some of you might think, no, nah, that's impossible. But no, there, there, was, there was totally a gate. I choose to believe there was a gate. I can't remember. It's a, it's a minor oversight in my memory. That, that's why I choose... That's what I choose to believe. That's that's the story I'm sticking with. In this part, though, I mean, who knows what's gonna happen? I already said that. Uh, Gellum is apparently going crazy. Uh, yeah, okay. There's nothing over here. On the other hand, let's go check out this mysterious pathway with a chest. Is it a mimic? Nope. Shellstone. I uh, don't know what that means. I like to think it's an item. It's an itemized version of shell. Bats! Oh man, I want a bat, but I can't get one. I cannot get one, despite all my efforts. I cannot, gra cannot grab one. Actually, it's a pretty legit mirage to have. Uh, there's not a lot of uses right now, but it does get pretty good later on. So I'm gonna say, if you want a mirage, any sort of mirage, you want something with potential, bats definitely have it. I think that one was a vampire bat. Could be wrong. Oh, by the way, you see this? Make sure you save. I know this is a little bit out of the blue and a little bit of a time-consuming thing to do, but just just make sure you save. It, it's very beneficial for you, for me, for everyone involved. Uh, it's Some of you might think it's unnecessary. Maybe, maybe you're trying to go for a non-save run of this game, beat it in one sitting. I would not do that. This game is really long. It's it's longer than one sitting. Let me put it that way. Oh no! What have I done? What have? Oh no! I have 15 minutes. I gotta go. This is the entire part. You know. Uh, Rain. What do those numbers floating? You know, in Final Fantasy, it was game over. It's not good. Nope. In Final Fantasy VII, you die. Let's get the out of here. So, uh, my only assumption is that I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die real hard. And so, game over. Not good. Um, on the other hand, you know, these, these battles, not fun. Don't really give a shit about them. I'm just gonna mow on through and, like, well, complete so everything. Bad. And, uh, the timer's still here, so not good. I remember the first time I did this, I was freaking out. I was like, oh, no, what, what am I gonna do? Going. Trust me, this is the right way. And I, I, I kind of panicked a little bit, much like my first run okay. of Final Fantasy VII. Roger that. Full speed ahead. I guess we're the doing this again. Fortunately, to ease your burden, all this stuff that you mess with is still like good. You don't have to mess with it again. You don't have to set it up. So that that's kind of nice on on all the parts. But at the same time, I mean, oh man, <laughs> how much time is this going to take me? It's been like a minute. I, I still got a lot to do. I don't think I could go this way. I'm going this way. Oh man, I, I gotta go this way. Uh, let's see. Aside from that, man, I, I don't have a lot of time, but I, I gotta know. There's something over here. There's also a battle over here. With some garbage. Absolute rubbish. Don't need it. Also, I like having the counter ability. Counter is very nice. It's, it's a good ability to have. Not so much if you're trying to capture some mirages, do the imprison thing, but it's nice if you're trying to have something on the offense. Uh, also, I have so many antidotes, apparently. I purchased the max limit. Uh, I, I guess that's not important. Not not too important, but I'm, I'm fine with that. Uh, I got a gimme golem over here. Oh man, I, I gotta, I gotta go to the thing with the gimme golem. I'm, I'm gonna do that. Uh, 
that that was a very weird place to just you know, have a random encounter, but you know, hey, it's, it's all good. I'm just rushed through this. There's nothing really to worry. All the enemies here have been pretty much a piece of cake. That's all I really had to say about it. Yeah, the reactor isn't as impressive as I think it would be. Uh, also, bombs are kind of an odd thing to have in a reactor. I mean, what if they explode and it causes a critical meltdown? Everything would go kaboom. What does he want? Dazzle disc? I already have that. I got that in the last part. It was in a chest just underneath the, some stairs. At least I think it was. Uh, it was in like this room even, so uh, yeah. Hey! Crisis averted! Oh man. Do I dare? Do, do I dare? Is this gonna be failure? Is it gonna be success? Does anyone... Oh man. Am I ready? Uh, you know what, viewers? I'm gonna cut it right here. Because uh, if, if this ends up being total failure, you'll know why. So, uh, funny thing about this room, uh, and the reason why I decided to cut it. Uh, you might not want to do it right now. I mean, you can, but it might result in the game over. It's a rare mirage. You get a memento if you are able to do it. But, I mean, even though I'm pretty OP right now... Uh, it's still a little challenging, so I, I'd wait on it. Uh, it it's, it's a challenge, but just kind of like, you're still a little too underleveled for it. Uh, I don't know why it's so extreme, but I guess, I guess the game developers got wise, and they're like, Oh, it's too easy, is it? Well, here, have a really giant, hard, difficult monster with the fuck-off ability. Or something like that. <laughs> so, you know, not really going to worry about it right now. We'll come back to it. I'll, uh... There'll be a video kind of doing all that, so don't worry about it right now. Right. Just move on with all the fancy, fun-filled Final Fantasy VII stuff we got going on here. Oh man, Billy Zane is already level 20. He's been leveling up like a champ. Uh, still a little under-leveled for my whole entire team, but hey, I'm not really worried about it. I should probably fill out his little uh, ability thing whatever did I go this way I don't think I did because there's a chest right there and I haven't opened it hi either's well you can go get those uh, if I if I showed that off before cutting it I don't remember I don't think I did though uh, it doesn't Sorry. matter no one really cares I'm just showing it off now anyways uh, yeah more trash more stuff you know it's pretty typical stuff but we're gonna move on to some actual plot and I'll be pretty sweet if you ask me oh man I hope all you're all excited for like more ply and trying to get everything going. Whereas November is also leveling up like a champ. Soon she'll be right on par with everyone else. That'll be pretty sweet. Also, if you hit that thing right past the gimme golem, it kind of unlocks everything, and that's also really sweet. Uh, also, we're underneath the bridge. That that's pretty all right if you ask me. What the heck is this? I can't interact with it. Actually, I think it's also another switch, much like the other one that we did. Uh, do I really need to save? I, I'm gonna do it anyways. Even though I kind of just did it. Uh, double save, everybody. We're doing a double save. Uh, cause, you know, if a, if, a, if a save spot is, like, right here, clearly they're trying to indicate there's, a ba there's about to be a ton of plot and something difficult. Like a boss fight or something. I mean, it's possible. I think everyone knows that's what's coming up. We're, we're getting close to the end of it. Oh, uh, is that... It's it's the it's the heart of the Mako reactor, or is it Mako? Could be Mako. What the honk? You don't think they're all the gonna? Looks like a major problem. Get it, mage? Do you think they're mirages? I can definitely sense the similarity. Then we know exactly what to do with them. Ah, uh, hey, I noticed that crooked hat anywhere. That's Vivi. Um, on the other hand, I guess I will use some Libra action. So what we got here? Reduce the Mirage's HP to create a Prism Opportunity. Well, in that case, uh, what what about the other ones? 
Should I should I try to figure out what we got going on for those guys? I guess I guess I could try that if I have a leap. I don't have a leaper thing. Okay. Um. Well, there is the boss music, so I mean, I, I guess for all intents and purposes, I'm I'm just focused on these guys. Oh, they're weak. And we got resist. So so already it's it's, like, it's we're already in a favorable position. All right. Let's see. Uh, Libra. There we go. Let's get some Libra action going on these guys. Uh, those are unimprisonable. So in that case, I guess I will focus on Vivi here. Wrong button. Right button. There we go. Wait. Did, did we not do the thing? Why didn't Why didn't the prism thing go... Okay, alright. Fine. Let's do it again. Why didn't do the thing? Do I have to, like, reduce it to critical or something? Um... There we go. There we go. I knew it. All right. Here we go. Prison baby. Yeah, let's do it. Let's catch a DV. Wait, what? What? <laughs> hey, who made all this smoke? Huh? So it can talk. I've heard it speak too. Whoa! A mirage that can talk? Hmm? So she can. That is odd. <laughs> you just noticed? So, kid, your name is Vivi? Mm hmm. So, your friends there, are all of them able to talk just like you do? Friends? Where? It's a bunch of me's! What? Uh, hey! Don't you realize they're dangerous? They are? Hey! You guys know better than to act mean! See? I knew they'd be reasonable! They even said they'll help us! Whoa! Color me impressed! Yes, bravo. Okay, so what can me and my friends do for you? Oh, actually... Happening. Does this mean the reactor's working? Figaro Castle can break the free now! Oh, hey! We don't want to miss this! Come on! Yeah, let's head outside! <laughs> it's time! Now, full speed ahead!
Yeah, no kidding. By the way, couldn't this be that cradle of Mako's light that has the key of Earth? You mean this key here? Huh? Dude, it's the second key. Ask and you shall receive. It appears that Vivi had it all along. Lucky the us. Again, <laughs> it all seems just <laughs> a little <laughs> too lucky. <laughs> but there's no yeah. point in dwelling on it right so now. Is this officially ours? So, Vivi, sure where will is. you go now? Hmm. How's this? Stay in Figaro. Huh? Hey, it's you! Ah, my favorite giants. Your help has been most invaluable. Uh, 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 didn't Squall relay my intentions? Yes. Well, listen, I... I am sorry. The Federation was watching me like a hawk, so I... <sighs> what about Lightning? Is she okay? Oh, yes. I made certain she escaped. After all, she wouldn't have been out there protecting you. Had I not asked. Huh? Seriously? She was part of this? Oh, then technically you did help us before you unhelped us. Yeah, I guess we're even now? Guess so. Uh, what was that? Where did it come from? Has it always been there? Lurking beneath Figaro? Incredible. That mirage that possessed power beyond the belief. Hmm. After all that I've put you through, this hardly suffices. But I have some information. Huh? One of the keys is in the land of naught but night, correct? Well, I may know where. Really? Where is it? To the west of here. You'll find Big Bridge, a colossal crossing that will take you to another continent. That particular continent gets no sunlight due to the thick, dark skies overhead. They even call it the land of the stolen sun. Really, how can the place not be naught but night? Oh boy, we got Shulk's champion medal. Um, I mean, I'm okay with that. Uh, as you can all guess, we're about to get into some new territory. We gotta cross Big Bridge, and that's all fine and dandy. Um, that was a lot of plot to comprehend. I'm gonna end the part here. Next time, uh, more plot. Also, Vivi is adorable. I like, I like, I like what they did with Vivi.